Hello everyone. Today in this video we are going to tell you about what is audit trail and how you can use this feature in Mark software. So firstly let us know what is an audit trail. As you already know it is mandatory by the government that the company who uses accounting software for maintaining their books of accounts then those companies should use that kind of accounting software in which there is a feature of audit trail so that you can check your each and every transaction like if you or your operators have done any modification then you should have a log of each and every modification and for this you have to use that software in which there is a feature of audit trail and this option is being developed in mark erp software for your convenience so let's come and see the complete process of the audit trail in mark software for this Firstly we will enable the audit trail option from the control room for which we will go to the masters menu then to mark setups and then click on the control room option from here click on search in all fields then in the search field we will search audit and click on the accept tab given here then from the drop down of activate audit trail from today option we will select yes to this option Now press the escape key twice and click on yes to the save changes window. Then this audit from date window will open. You will mention that date here from which you want to view the audit trail report. After this, go to the daily reports menu, then to the audit trail option and here three options will be shown to you. So firstly we will come to the bill value changes option. From this bill value changes tab you can view the details of that bill in which you have done the changes. Like in bill value, item quantity, or that bill which you have cancelled or deleted. So, firstly, in the period field, you will select that date range, that is from which date till which date you want to view the audit trail report. Then, from the drop down of filter, you will select the transaction type of whichever transaction you want to view the audit trail, that is sale, purchase, sale return, purchase return, or all. Suppose we will select all. Then from the next drop down we will select that the software should show what type of changes in the report like changes done in the bill value item quantity or cancel and delete bills or in the selected period the number of transactions that are been done then the software should show you all types of changes in the report you will select this as per your requirement suppose we will set this field to all then is difference minimum field if you want to view the bill value report here up to any particular amount or percentage then you can mention that amount or percentage here else you can keep this field as blank after this from here we will click on show so all those bills will be shown to you according to the selected date range in which the changes are done by you or by your operators now in order to view the detailed information of any bill you will click on the view button given next to that bill so in this way you can view the details of the selected bill like which operator has created the bill how many times modification or changes are done in the bill and when it is done etc all these things will be displayed next field is the user audit trail from here you can view the working of your operator when you click on the user audit trail option then this window of the user workbook will be shown to you along with some fields Firstly in the period field select the date range accordingly that is from which date till which date you want to view the audit trail report then from the drop down of the user field you will select the operator or user that is of which operator you want to view the audit trail report and if you want to view the report of all the operators then select the user field to all then from the drop down of based on field You will select on what basis you want to view the report of selected operator that is bill chalan accounts or you want to view the report of everyone you can select this as per your requirement then click on show so the number of your user or operators will get displayed in the list along with it which operator has generated how many bills and which operator has modified how many bills all these will be displayed to you and also on the right side here operator wise transactions will get displayed to you so of whichever operator you want to view the complete details select that operator 
so here the selected operator has generated the bills of which all customers the bills of which customers are modified on which date it has been done what is the amount what is the bill number etc all these details will be shown now of whichever particular entry you want to view the audit trail report you will select that customers entry from the entries shown here and then press enter on it then two options will be shown to you from which you will click on audit trail after that the company report will be shown to you of that entry after this next is random stock checking through this option you can cross check the physical and the software stock of the company because sometimes what happen is that we are not able to check the available products in our stock on daily basis so with the help of random stock checking option you can randomly cross check your few products or items in your stock so when you will click on this option then the company list will be shown to you you will keep selecting those companies by pressing the space bar key of which you have to check the stock or product and if you want to select all companies then by pressing shift plus asterisk key you will select all companies and press enter after this a pop up message of random items will be shown in which you can mention the items count as per your requirement of the number of items you want to check the stock and then press enter so in this way you can match the closing stock with the physical stock according to the selected companies and count of the random item so friends in this way you can use the audit trail option in mark software thanks for watching